this is Kukina. <laughs> We'd like to welcome you to the Kina the Cougar Show. So don't forget to like the video if you like the video. Subscribe. Put a comment down below. All right, we're going to get right into it. Tonight we got Lisa Bonet. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 I like her. Yeah. So she's 53 years old, and all the young slabs seem to fall for her. Wow. She seems to have an appeal for them. Oh, yeah. Okay. You know, the Cubs <laughs> even get nervous when trying to get caught. Wow. Can you believe that? Okay. Yeah, so it's obvious she's got some kind of love potion number nine. <laughs> <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> she's doing something. I mean, don't get me wrong. She's a cute girl, but I mean, you know, I try to be funny, but I mean, you know, she's, <laughs> you know, it is what it is. Okay. So, and they even say she's intimidating at times while trying to date, you know, from her relationships. She's had plenty of, plenty of headlines from her relationships and everything, guys. Okay. I mean, you know. But, you know, I will say, these days it does seem more common for a younger man to date a cougar. It just does. Well, I mean, you know. It just it's, uh, it's a regular thing, guys. And it's, you know, once everyone realizes it, you know. <laughs> well, we can all see it. Let's put it like that. <laughs> you know. So, she's been married twice to Lenny Kravitz, who I like Lenny for sure. Uh, yeah. Uh, great music, yeah. seems like a nice guy. I mean, I've never met him, but uh, I do like him, so. You? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do I? I told yeah. you. Oh. <laughs> Listen, well, tell Lenny, you. Hey, if you're watching Lenny, I'm, I'm not. <laughs> oh, yeah, Lenny. Yeah. Yeah, his music's awesome, I gotta say. And then she's currently with and married to is Jason Momoa, who is 12 years her junior, guys. So, like I said, Lisa Bonet, she's pulling the right toe. <laughs> hey. Okay. <laughs> so she's definitely in the cougar category. Sounds like to me, this cougar makes her ball spray. <laughs> It does, it does, guys. It does, it does. Yeah, it does. So it, it's obvious she's dated quite a few guys, varieties, styles, ages, you know, the cougar package. But I will say, you know, the young hunks go for her, so she you know, it's one or two things, and I'll leave that to you to figure that out. Yeah. So just to name a couple is Brian Kess. Corey Parker and Damon Marley. Okay. Yeah. Alright. So moving right along. Coming up, we got Clint Eastwood. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I will say I, I, I like him a lot. Uh, I mean yeah. I, I grew up watching the, the westerns. Uh, me and my dad used to watch westerns. That was our thing, you know. So I grew up watching him on that. I, I mean, he's had a lot of great movies, I will say, uh, starred in and directed. Yeah. And if I'm not mistaken, they say he's the oldest celebrity currently alive. So we, we wish you the best, Plenty Swell. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, I, I mean, I'm like a 99.9. Yeah. Yeah, That's almost awesome. 100. Yeah, and he's the, the, the oldest celebrity still alive. I guess you know? so. Yeah, so he's 91. You know, and he's dated a lot of the most beautiful girls in Hollywood. He's a lucky man there. You know, what can I say? You know, nothing else to be said. You know, so he truly is happy with his cubs. Okay. But I will say, it does seem like, you know, they don't last long. I don't know. So he's had quite a few relationships that weren't serious. And encounters, you know, so, you know, but I will say, he shows a type of intensity when it comes to certain cubs. Claws out guys, and he's ready to move in on that meat. All right, now, okay. Yeah. 
So he's been married twice also. Maggie Johnson and Dina Eastwood, who was 36 years his junior, okay? Mm -hmm. Then he was with Christina Sandria, who was 36 years his junior also. So I hate to say it, but I mean, you know, he's definitely in the mentor category supreme. Folks, this mentor, he hits me on another level. <laughs> Yeah, no, 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 I gotta say, I gotta say, I gotta give you that one. He does, he does. Yeah, so he's obviously dated quite a variety. I'd say the list is up there probably with the top dogs because he's 91 years old, so he's got a couple of years on him, you know what I mean? Right. But just to name a couple, we got Diana Ruiz, Barbara Streisand, Francis Fisher, Danny Crean, okay. and Jane Cameron. So as you can see, you know, it's a variety. On a whole nother level. On a whole nother level. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's just what it is. Yeah. You know? Yeah, so you can see. Yeah. You know? Hey. Okay. <laughs> yeah, not too bad. All right. You know, so. And I want to think, oh man, I think I've seen something like 60 some odd plus uh, like uh, documentaries or, you know, true life stories. Right. And I've seen quite a couple and they are impressive. So. And uh, we wish you the best, Glenn. Uh, keep yeah. rocking, buddy. Yeah. And 91 and still working. I mean, yeah, that's, that's awesome. That's yeah, awesome. I take my hat off to you, I'll, I'll be honest. So do I. You know, so coming up, moving right along. We got Bill Clinton. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, that's, that's. Got it. <laughs> that's like, look, we gotta do it again. Yeah. That's like, <laughs> you know, so, so he's 74 and obviously current with Hillary, you know, but he was involved in a political sex scandal that involved a White House intern for two years. You know, all that. He Monica Lewinsky, you guys know on the news, you know, oral on the oval. You know. <laughs> but it does sound funny, you got it, man. <laughs> it does sound funny, you know. So there's also another one. Her name is Jennifer. And she said she had a 12-year relationship with Clinton as a mistress, and it started two years after he got married. So. So he just didn't even he didn't even have enough of the scandal. He went back back out there and did it again. Yeah. Well, I think he did this one uh, before or during the same time. Uh, but it's a quite a thing. I mean, I, you know. But long story short, I mean, 12 years. Regardless of the fact. Regardless of the fact. He still was a thought. Absolutely. <laughs> All right. He was Absolutely. I mean, he only waited two years, so you guys already know. I mean, and I'll be honest, I'm not trying to be funny, but Hillary does look pretty boring. I mean, I mean you know, she strikes me as one of them fish that are, you know, her, her flat don't even flat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, <laughs> the fish guy, yeah. Because it, yeah. Ain't, it ain't stopped yeah, 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 yeah. But I will say, Jennifer, when she uh, she came out, it was at a devastating time for him. It was right around the 92 election. But despite all that, he still won, and him and Hillary are still together, 50 years married at this point. So, you know, I do got to take my hat off a little bit for them working out the situation. You don't see that much these days. But... You know, guys, it could have been just for the image, not because they wanted to, you know. So, moving right along. He was married, he was with Monica Lewinsky, who was, you know, we all know that, which is 30 years his junior. Uh -huh. He was with Belinda Strawning, which was 17 years his junior. So he's definitely in the Mantha category. This Mantha show like his mystery me. <laughs> I'm telling you. Oh, yeah. I'm telling you. I mean, come on, guys. He had a mistress for 12 years. He, he like his mistress. had Monica for two years. Yeah, oh, it was like Jennifer it. that was the 12 year mistress. So, for 14 years out of the marriage, he's had two mistresses that we know about. Yeah, and he was a thought. Yeah. <laughs> and he was a thought. You know, self explanatory. Yeah. So, he's obviously had quite a variety. Exactly. Kind of style, the whole nine. You know, guys. Exactly. The mantra category. Yeah. But just to name a couple. We got Jennifer Flowers, who was the mistress for 12 years. You know, Patricia Duff, Sally Perdue, and Dolly Browning. So, definitely a variety there. 
Well, listen, guys, it was a real fun show again tonight. We'll catch up with you next time. Peace. Bye.